it's Takara, and today I'm going to be talking about the Dream Showcase event. Consider subscribing to my channel for more content like this as I play actively in the Japanese and English Love Nikki servers and in the Shiny Nikki Global server. But anyways, let's go ahead and get started. So the devs announced the return of an event with these two suits right here. Here is one of the suits and here is the other suit. So this is a pavilion event. It is only one pavilion so the two suits don't have like separate pavilions. You actually get both of them from the same pavilion and the average cost to complete the pavilion is going to be around like 4,000 diamonds. Again, since it's a pavilion, it depends on luck. So, um, I have absolutely nothing from this event. I think I was like on like a break whenever the event last came to us. I think the last time the event actually came to us was in August 2019, which I was still pretty new at the time, but I also remember I wasn't playing the game at that time, so I literally had no chance to even pull in the pavilion, so I have absolutely nothing here, which is why we're gonna have to take a look at them from the gallery. So we have the showcase of a dream suit, she has this hair right here, this dress, these shoes. Um, I'm not exactly sure what this is. It might be like a foreground item. And then we have her crown. These are her bracelets. It's like a glove item, I think. And I can barely even see what it is. I think that's her necklace, though. And then we have the gigantic bow. I think this bow is in, like is like a wing or a tail. I honestly don't know because I don't have the suit. And um, she also has this pose right here, which this is actually a, it's a nice pose, I guess. But again, when do you really ever use poses like this? As for this suit, I don't care about it. Like, I genuinely don't care about this style at all, so I can live perfectly fine without the suit. The items aren't really, like, something that I will absolutely need, but, I mean, I guess it could be a nice suit to have. But I feel like she would just sit useless in my wardrobe, so I am perfectly fine with not getting her, and I don't care that I don't even have her. Now, let's take a look at this suit right here. So, this suit has this blonde hair, and it actually has like something attached to the hair, which is unfortunate. I don't like it when hairs have things have like um head ornaments attached to it because that makes it a lot less versatile but you know what there's nothing we can really do about that this dress is actually pretty nice it is sleeveless so you could use separate arm poses with it matter of fact this dress right here is also sleeveless and since it's actually pretty um short you could use some leg poses with it i guess but i still don't care about the style okay and she has uh this right here you know how rude you are? Oh my god. Okay, Luna, here. Okay, you can be here. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. So, we have this item right here. It's either a hosiery or a leglet item. I'm gonna think it's a leglet because of what it looks like. And then these shoes right here. Uh, these shoes really aren't special. I don't care about them. Now, this item right here... This is a very interesting and nice item. It has a layering effect to where you can put your Nikki inside of the box. And, uh, this is probably the only item I actually like from the entire event. So, uh, yeah. And she also has this poodle right here, which the poodle is cute, I guess? But I don't really use the animals that we have in the game like that. So I don't care about the poodle. Um, the earrings, we have earrings that look exactly like these, who cares? Uh, this necklace, who cares? What even is that? I think that's a bracelet. Yeah, I couldn't even know what it was. <laughs> and then we have this purse right here. Does it have like candy in it? What even is that? I don't even know, but um, 
and it's nothing that special and this is like a perfume handheld i see it in her other hand and she has this makeup in which this makeup actually looks pretty weird to me it might just be me but i don't really like the makeup and then oh i'm not trying to go back to her and when you complete the suit you will get the pose and what else is there fantasy showcase what is that uh let me actually look and see what that item is fantasy showcase okay okay um fantasy showcase it's another box i think oh um I think this is the box with the poodle inside of it. I don't know why they did that though. Like, why do we need two boxes and one of them has to have a poodle in it? What was the point of this? Don't even ask me because I don't know, but okay, you'll also get that when you complete the suit. All right, let's go back to the suits. Okay, so we're back at the suits. I think I pretty much um, showed them and stated my opinion on them. I'm I might be like a bit more harsher and like not like that loving of these suits mainly because it's not my style if you watch my videos you know i am in love with the gothic style so i don't really care about these styles literally the only item i would ever use would be this giant box right here in which i'm pretty sure this is like the last item most people will even get and uh i really don't want to spend four thousand diamonds on one item <laughs> like because i swear literally everything else from this event would literally be useless to me so um i can proudly skip this event honestly i can live without this box even though it is a pretty useful and nice item i can live just fine without it and I know I say that with like every pavilion, but I end up getting it anyways. So let's just all just wish me the best of luck with my pavilion addiction. Because I swear, sometimes I say that I'm just going to be skipping the pavilion. And then I end up getting the pavilion. But I think that I can actually skip this event because the suits here aren't my style at all. I don't care about this style. So yeah, it doesn't really fit my taste and my standards so i can proudly skip this event and i mean even if you like the cuter style this might be more worth it but we do have a lot of better suits that are in the same style that you could get so i feel like even if you like the cutesy style this might not be the most worth it but again this is all my opinion and how i view things if you think this suit is absolutely worth it feel free to get it but just know that i am not getting it at least i hope i'm not gonna be getting it so yeah if you have any questions or future video ideas please let me know in the comments below but anyways that's all i have for today i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you next time bye